oh my god, she ain't sure. Video games, films, and TV shows all have one thing in common. Complex plots and detailed lore. But what if we scrap that idea entirely? This is... Subnautica is a video game best described as Finding Nemo meets Survivor, but with more screaming and less talking fish. The game starts with the player crash landing on an alien planet that is completely submerged in water, and it turns out just about every life form wants to eat you. As you explore, you make a discovery. The planet is infected. Oh shit, not good. As a result, the planet, in its delirious and bug brain state, decided it would blast your ship out of space, and that is why you're trapped on this godforsaken seascape. Throughout the game you encounter alien creatures, alien ruins, and alien tech. I did mention this was an alien planet, right? Bad news. I forgot to mention you're infected too, but don't worry about that, it's not really important. Good news however, you've got god-given talent at crafting, have the sickest base on the planet, and a pimping cyclops. What more could you want? And don't you dare say multiplayer. After delving deeper, and avoiding every form of leviathan the game throws at you, we discover the cure to the infection. Good, right? No. Well, kind of. Remember that laser cannon from earlier? You know the one, that caused us to crash? It needs shutting down before we have a hope in hell of leaving. But wait, we're in luck. It turns out by curing the planet of its infection, we can magically turn it off now. Brilliant. Long story short, now we've disabled the alien defense system, we can craft a rocket and get the hell out of here. Luckily, we can use random bits and bobs we find on the seabed, and we escape the planet. Nice job. Now you can load up a new save, and do it all again. So, to summarise, Subnautica is a game where you swim. <laughs> <laughs>